is National Entrepreneur Day. And instead of focusing on a Minnesotan to meet who was born and raised here, today we introduce you to an entrepreneur who is one of Minnesota's newest residents. Rob Walling is the co-founder of what used to be Fresno, California-based Drift. His company was acquired by a Minneapolis-based tech company, and that company is Lead Pages. While he hasn't been in Minnesota very long, making the leap with his business and family seemed to be a pretty worthy cause for him to be a Minnesotan you should meet. Just a tiny little room. With Rob Walling decided to make Minneapolis home in July. We were staying in Airbnbs for two or three weeks until we found a place to rent. The co-founder of tech company Drip followed his wife around while she was working on her PhD. I've lived in Pasadena and Fresno and Sacramento and Boston and New Haven and some of those towns have done a really good job of revitalizing their downtown like they've done here. This is this is one of the more vibrant, you know, downtowns. Now it was his time to make the call on the family's next destination. A little over three months ago, he moved into his new warehouse district-based office. So far, he says he likes what he's seen. It seems like to me like it's a good blend of the bootstrap scene that I was involved in and the, the funded scene in the Bay Area without too much of the craziness. He started dabbling in software development at a very young age. But Walling says Drip is different. Drip was definitely the biggest and the fastest growing. Uh, it was the largest market that we'd ever attacked. In a nutshell, Drip is an email marketing automation software that helps customers connect and communicate in a very targeted manner. If you have an audience that you want to communicate with, uh, the old way to do it was to send out a big email blast to all of your audience. So if you have 50,000 people, you might send a single email to all of them, which means a lot of it isn't relevant to those folks. Whereas with something with a tool like Drip and, and its competitors, you can send really targeted emails. So it's like you choose you only want to hear about technology or you only want to hear about the economy or you only want to hear about Syria. Walling says he was approached by several companies, but the acquisition with Minneapolis-based Lead Pages seemed to make the most sense when looking ahead to the future. Lead Pages and Drip have a real strategic um, kind of linkage because Lead Pages is landing pages and a lot of bloggers and e-commerce folks and online businesses use landing pages to help gather they build their list. The father of two is enjoying focusing on his business and the things he's good at. My expertise is in building great product but there's all this stuff surrounding that like HR, legal, accounting, hiring support people, hiring customer success, like there's all these roles even even like marketing, sales. His new office certainly has the look and feel of a startup. Like the beauty of, of having you know swings and snacks and all that stuff it's like the extra stuff. You can go anywhere and, and get a job as a developer, yeah. but um, you know I think that there's I don't know there's just certain benefit to having extra stuff that that's unique that you're not going to get at a big big Fortune 500 company. Despite moving here from the West Coast, he says bring on the Minnesota winter. I've heard you can skate on the lake during the winter, so people tell me it's hard to believe it's going to freeze in a month or two. <laughs> well, there you go, Matt. Yeah. When is it going to freeze over? He's heard. Few days. <laughs> Word on the street is that you can skate on the lakes. Uh -huh. It's true. You can yeah. drive on true. them, too. Wait till <laughs> that not, would blow your not mind. Not just yet, though. You have that to wait. That would blow your mind. Uh, he was biking to work in the summer, but I interviewed him about two weeks ago. He stopped that. A yeah. little too cold uh, yeah. for, for yeah. the California give him a, boy. Give him another year. He'll buy one of those, like, studded tire <laughs> bikes. He'll hipster up. So he yeah. moved here, and his company was bought by Lead, Lead Pages, Pages. Yeah, which so, is a big Minnesota. Yep, he moved uh, four of his employees here, and then since he's joined Lead Pages, they've been able to hire three more people. Right. right? So it's all about, I know some of this stuff it might be a little confusing to yes. people, but this is... You know, it's all about marketing and about gathering information about kind of the way you use the internet. And, and yeah. Lead Pages is a pretty well known company. They have 156 employees and they recently uh, raised about $27 million last year in wow. 2015. Wow. So they're getting a lot of funding and they have a lot of support yeah. and they're very well known. Started in the tech by world. a Minnesotan, so yep. pretty good. Cool. cool.